What is going on guys? Brandon here, Mitten Made Properties. We have your January 2021, finally in the new year, real estate market update for Genesee County. Let's get right into this. I always preface with a couple things. We have three years of data, that way you can see the trend. The trend is your friend, remember that. And then we have the month in arrears going back because we have all the data now. It's all in, it's off the press, got it for you. So let's get in, get out, get after it. Days on market, DOM, anytime you see that. Days on market, 63 two years ago, 61 last year, and down to 40 this year. So we're seeing incredible turns, obviously in the last year or so, with days on market and what's going on. This is obviously before the pandemic started. So. I'm going to see a lot of this craziness going on here really throughout Metro Detroit. Active number of homes, 783 two years ago, 781 last year, and then 316 this year. That's insanity in half, less than half. And this is the number of homes at the day the data was taken. So that's a one-day sample size. Months of inventory is three two years ago, 2.65 last year, and then one this year. That's incredible. And just to give you context, one is uh, one to three is a seller's market meaning that there are not a ton of homes on the market. Prices are going up. Four to six is a balanced market. And then seven plus is a buyer's market like we had 10 years ago. So I just give you some context there. And that's the rate that, that homes are, are changing basically. So if no new homes came on the market, how long would it take to sell every last home? That is the month of inventory. Just a quick ratio to kind of see what kind of market we're in without having to dive into the rest of the data. New homes in the market this is a month wide number. 543 two years ago, 460 total came on last January, and then 370 this year. So a little bit of a decrease still going forward. So we're, we're going lower and lower in the inventory. It's incredible. And we already had the record lowest amount of homes on the market ever recorded uh, nationally through, through the MLS. So it's going to be crazy to see what, it goes, what happens here going forward. Price per square foot. 100 uh or sorry the 84 dollars square foot two years ago 89 last year and 107 this year that's going to continue to go up obviously with record low inventory and low interest rates you can multiply that by the square footage of your home and approximately get the the value of your home again if you want a true appraisal though you need an appraiser or someone on our team someone to come give you an actual valuation on your home number of sold this is the number of people actually closed on their home signed on the dotted line and closed on a home in the month of january 284 last year, 295, or two years ago, 295 last year, and then 305 this year. So again, a little bit of increase here. Not much though, because uh, there's not much on the market. And again, remember, we're getting to the end of that big glut in the homes, the last half of last year that came on the market, which wasn't that much actually, but people are really going with the risk curve and they're buying anything they get their hands on. Homes that might've been sitting just are going now. People are, are biting the bullet. So that's your January 2021 market update for Genesee County. Let me know what questions, comments, concerns you have. Appreciate your time, your, your attention, your energy. It's the most important asset that we have. So I thank you. If you're on the podcast, go to at Legacy Group MI on the Facebook or YouTube channel. Go check it out there and leave your questions and comments there. And we'll see you guys on the next one.